Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and welcome to Problem Solving 1. Um, so this is an extension of a video we did, I guess, two videos ago, and how to solve a problem. So this is actually based upon a problem that came through our Discord server that has the link down below. So if you're interested in that, make sure you're clicking that link and jumping over there and asking any questions. And Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button for me. So, all right. What the challenge is, is you're given a string. You're given a string. You have to return a string of a high number and a low number. So, let's just give you the example. So, the definition that we're going to have is high, low. And it takes a string. Of numbers. We're going to do numbers, but so an example is you pass it a string like so: six, five, one, negative two, and seven. And this then would return. Let's comment this out. And then it would return a string like so. And it's going to do high and then low. So it would return 6 space negative 2. So this is what we need to work through right now. So think about what this problem really truly is. So we are taking in a string. We need to, we need to order this. So we need to do some way to sort then we need to return back to or back to that's a foreshadowing uh, string and I didn't put the R in here so we need to really kind of lay this out how in the world can we do this so we can't we can't sort a string but we can sort a list, okay? So how do we get a string? How do we get a string from a list? Okay, wait a minute. If I do, if I go help uh, string string dot split, was it split? Or if I can't even remember, let's do dir on string. So let's look at everything we can do with, okay, it, it, there is one called split. So let's do help on str.split. What does this do? Returns a list. Boom. Okay. So I'm going to then take, I'm going to do string dot split. Okay. So then I have my then I have my string, or then I have my list, okay. Then I need to put this in order. I can do a sort on the list. And let's see, how do I do, how do I do this? Let's do help, help dot list dot sort. What does this do? Because I need this, I need, I need this to be high and then low. So this goes in ascending order. So wait a second. I'm going to sort my list. Sort. And then I'm going to do, I'm going to reverse it. Okay. So I have, I have part of it. And then I need to return a string. Well, how do I going to do that? Wait a minute. I can do this in string format. String. So I'm going to do an F string. All right. Okay. So now I've roadmapped this. So before I wrote any piece of code, I thought this out, knew how I was going to attack it. And this may not be perfect, but I'm going to start. I'm just going to start right here. So I have print high low and I'm going to pass it 
just going to pass it this. This is my test right here. All right. So I'm going to take numbers and I'm going to split it. So uh, split, what does, what does split do? Split returns a list. Okay. And this is, we're just going to call this temp equals numbers dot split. All right. Return temp. Okay. I run this. Okay. So now here I am. I have my list right here. Now, what does what does sort do? Sort lists in ascending order in place. So I cannot I cannot assign this to a new variable. So I'm going to sort. So it's going to I leave my leave my return. All right. That's right. I was going to do this in reverse. So because if I were to do this, we're going to now we're going to do reverse. So reverse equals true. Is that how this works? Reverse. Yep. Okay. All right. And see, this was completely wrong. This is supposed to be seven and negative two. So that's why we run. Okay. So now. So I'm partially the way there. I'm two thirds of the way, so I'm getting very close. So I'm not returning this. I'm going to be returning my F string and just the first element and the last element. That's what I want you to look at. So temp and, and I forgot my brackets, temp. zero close brackets and brackets temp negative one and close brackets all right let's test and see where we are and boom and we could run this several times copy paste 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 and we change this to five one zero seven eight nine negative five and so on nine one zero seven negative ten zero one two nine eleven minus hundred all right so let's run these so high to low, seven, two, nine, five, nine. I guess I had a lot of nines in there. Nine, negative 10, nine, 100. So this, this is what I want you to get out of this. I wrote, it was three simple. This is what I want you to look at. Three simple layouts. And I ran it every single time. So I got back what I was expecting or what I wasn't expecting. Like I, d I did a quick one of, here we were. I thought it was going to be, I forgot there was a seven in there. But that was our split. That was our sort. Our sort wasn't right. So I ran it again. I put in uh, true. And then my last, my last part. But this is how you take a problem, you dissect it, you break it down, you make it small, you make it solvable. I hope you guys really got something out of this. I really hope you liked this video. Give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button, notification bell, so you don't miss a, any videos coming out. We have a ton of them. Jump over to that Discord server so you're not in this alone. That's why I made this community. I built this community, and I've had help. I'm not doing this by myself. You're not going to be doing this by yourself. And make sure you're staying tuned. Can't get that right. Stay tuned until over there at the end so you can check out some of these videos because there are 910 videos for this video right here. You're not alone. So thanks for watching, stay tuned, and we'll see you next time. Bye guys. Hey guys, thanks for joining us today. I hope you really enjoyed today's video. And if you haven't, check out this video right here or this one right down here. And most important, make sure you're hitting this subscribe button and the notification bell. 
Thanks again for joining us, and we hope to see you next time. Bye, guys.